This morning, Halloween is creeping ever closer. It is only 11 days away now, and just like with any big event, we are here to fact check and verify the claims that you might see online. This morning, our Abby Larico is outside to verify a post about keeping your pumpkins popping through the fall. Hey, Abby. <laughs> Hey ladies, good morning. Yeah, about a week and a half till Halloween and especially if you're one of those people who waited all year to get your fall decor out on the porch, you want to make sure it lasts a while and maybe even into the fall. So we're taking a look at this Facebook meme shared here. It says that one way to make your pumpkin last longer is with a bleach bath, but it also cautions that's bad for wildlife. So we're verifying does bleach extend the life of a pumpkin and is it dangerous for critters? We turn to these sources to verify. First, does bleach extend the life of a pumpkin? On the surface of that pumpkin, there's lots of fungi and bacteria and things that will eventually break through the skin of the pumpkin. John Porter, urban agriculture educator with the University of Nebraska, explains, yes, using diluted bleach to sanitize that pumpkin can extend the pumpkin's life. It will actually uh, kill the bacteria and fungi. Clorox, a company that makes bleach, even includes a pumpkin bleaching tutorial on its website. Okay, so is it safe? For wildlife and people, yes. The key is to use it correctly. Dilute it, no more than a tablespoon of bleach per gallon of water, and use the solution in a well-ventilated area. Once it's dilute and once it's open to the air, bleach actually dissipates very quickly. So within 24 hours, all of that bleach is gone from the surface of that pumpkin. That means shortly after spritzing your pumpkin, it's front porch ready. Though Porter recommends waiting a bit longer if you bleach the more absorbent inside of a jack-o'-lantern. There is minimal risk to wildlife. Most people don't realize that um, many of the pumpkins and things that you buy uh, from the grocery store or the farmer's market has probably already been at one point washed with, with bleach. Now, the Virginia Department of Wildlife Resources says pumpkins like these are a treat for raccoons and squirrels, but so are little pieces of plastic debris like from candy wrappers. So make sure to keep an eye on that kind of trash this time of year as well. Wait, quick question, Abby. When we hear bleach, we're like, oh, it's a little harsh. I know that post mentioned something about vinegar. Is that a good alternative? Yeah, I asked Porter about that. He says there's not a lot of evidence that actually does much to extend the life of your pumpkin, but things like spreading a little Vaseline on the inside of it can keep it from drying out or sprinkling some cayenne pepper on the inside can deter wildlife. Mm -hmm. But we also were talking about it. You know, it is a seasonal thing, and if nature needs to run its course, then that's okay, too. <laughs> okay, sure good to is. know. Thanks, Abby.